<clears throat> you know, I'm all googly eyed for you, Victoria. I just noticed. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Let's get her on the frame. <clears throat> hey, Victoria, welcome. <clears throat> welcome. Jesus. Excuse me. Yeah, that's right. Welcome to another exciting episode of Feel It Real Fun for You on our 16th of August, 2022. Well, let's share it in the Dream Driven Day group, too. And the topic of today is revision versus reality revisited. <coughs> so does that mean there's a show happening at the moment with no one on it? No. From the notification? No, no, no. no. I couldn't get that to work right. It, okay. When Facebook makes me dick around, look at me. Do I look like I dick around? <laughs> uh, well. <laughs> like, really? <laughs> anyway. Yes. Uh, manifesting Mastery, Jonathan is in the house. Hello, Jonathan. Triple D, Nancy Hello, is Nancy. in the house. Hello, Jessica. Jessica. So go is to easymanifestingmethods.com. Yes, yeah, sign up to get the free little videos and the other shit, the daily email, so on and so forth. You must find and click on that their, uh, that their um, uh, confirmation link in the confirmation email we send you. If it's not in your inbox, check, comfort, check promotions and spam, drag it to where it should go. Luke, I am your father. Hello, Luke. <laughs> and so on. So, and Olive. Hello. Olive. <laughs> Brian Hello, Myers Brian. is in the building. Okay. Mm. Uh, join our 90 day adventure at manifestingmasterycourse.com. If you've done it, type it in real quick. Just type in MM and maybe a thumbs up or something. Just for fun. Let us know. Because we forget. Do you? Well, look at me. <laughs> Does he <laughs> look at me, look at me. forgets? So. Well, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> <laughs> I just love how it goes on forever. Anyway. <laughs> And for refunds, visit our YouTube channel, feelitrealfun.com. That is the rightness, John Manson. Hello, John Manson. Oh, Joel. 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 Uh, triple D people. Boom. All right. Okay. So a year ago, we did a show that was revision versus reality. And we're going to revisit that. Right? And when you catch the loopy reason why, you'll get why I'm wearing these glasses. And the old mm. title of the show was, Does Revision Change Reality? Yes. Mm. All right. Okay. It's Sizzler. Mm. Hello, Sizzler. Yo, Sizzle. <laughs> mm. Triple D, Remarkable, Sizzle Man. Yeah. Colby is here. Okay, so... so Angela. <laughs> Hello, Angela. All right, so, Victoria. Yes. Let's stop dicking around. All right. All right. So, are we going to start with the reader's email oh, of that course. was we're, maybe we're five years ago this. or something? This was a year ago. A year ago. A year ago. Okay. We're revisiting it. So, our reader, a year ago, asked... Can I manifest a completely new life and not be haunted by my past self and life? All I want is to not be confronted with my past. All right. So so we're sort of getting to a desire, right? So like mm. like like all I want is to not eat fish sticks for lunch today. I don't <laughs> You could have this, 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 exactly. It goes forever, so doesn't it? So what's the desire? So what's the yeah. desire, right? Now, here's the cool thing, right? So I got a question. I need you people to help answer Taya. Uh -huh. Help answer Taya. <laughs> help answer Brian. Right? Yes. I need you all to help answer things for me, right? Uma, 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 shaga. Right? Mm. So when, where would you be haunted by, uh, confronted with in your past? By your past, with your past? Gets confusing, doesn't it? Right, because yeah. because the pa you you can right now, right, passively uh, experience the past, passive mm. experience the past, right, or you can actively imagine something, right, uh, which just might be the nature of revision. But Victoria, we have a Neville Goddard quote today. Okay. Look at that. It's not real long either. I'm Good. I'm, I'm being very nice to you today because she is making us pork chops. Perry oh, yeah. Culver. <laughs> Hello, Perry. <laughs> okay, so right. Neville said, the outer world is a delayed reflection of the inner and is confined to a dimension of space where events occur in a time sequence. All right, so let's do a quick pause Taya, yeah thank you these are like my special glasses right <laughs> i look at these and i say do i look like i dick around <laughs> like really it's so much fun <laughs> right victoria calls them my, my making love glasses right? no i don't <laughs> oh, ever <laughs> she goes hey put them making love glasses on <laughs> radio <laughs> see i'm revising okay. last night right now so <laughs> the outer world right is a delayed reflection notice neville isn't saying it's not real Right? It's a reflection, it's the shadow right, of the inner and is confined to a dimension of space where events occur in a time sequence. 
You ever notice like when you imagine things, you can bounce all over the place. When you're dreaming, you can bounce all over the place in time and space. Uh, the outer world, notice he's not saying reality. Notice mm. he's not saying illusion. Mm. He's calling it uh, something really profound. This is what I love about Neville. Ready? He calls it the outer world. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I just love that. <laughs> Colby, you were absolutely right. Mm. The future's so bright, i got to wear shades, Victoria. Mm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Let us continue. Okay, so revision then literally changes the past. All right. It replaces what occurred in the outer world with the revised version. I know. Someone's going to ask how. Ready? Play. Right? How do you kiss someone? Right? <clears throat> I remember the first time I kissed Pam Wilkins. She said... <laughs> Let me show you something. <laughs> Let me show you how it's done. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she, yes. she said, hey, <clears throat> sit. Oh, sit. All right. <laughs> I can do that, right? Very good boy. Yes. <laughs> okay, good boy. Anyway, <laughs> continue, Victoria. The revised scene then gives off its effect by going forth to change future events. All righty So, uh, the outer world. The inner mm. world. Now remember, consciousness is the only reality. Somebody write that down because it's really important, right? Consciousness is the only reality, right? Now, instead of consciousness, what are you aware of? Right? <clears throat> Anyone? <laughs> See, Sorry, say that again. Inside of consciousness. What's inside of consciousness? What are you aware of? Me. All right. What else? <laughs> uh, there's the inner experience, quote unquote, the outer experience, the imaginal experience, the physical experience, oh, okay. what you think, your emotions, all that shit. Yes. <clears throat> now, here's the cool thing. Consciousness is the only reality. How you're aware of anything being determines how it is being in your life, right? And this is what makes it so much fun because you can passively attempt to remember something in the past, right? And let it bother you, right? You can haunt yourself. How cool is that? <laughs> you ever do that, Victoria? Yeah. Oh, my God. Right? <laughs> On the other hand, you, yes. you could really remember a yum. <clears throat> you could really re remember a yum. Sizzle is letting us know audio is good Yeah, because Jonathan said it's cutting out for him occasionally. All so, right. Jonathan, uh, sorry. Jonathan, that's you need, your yeah, outer yeah, world. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> Jonathan, you need to get an iPhone. Oh, right? sorry. <laughs> right? iPhone. iPhone. <laughs> iPhone, in case you didn't hear it. Okay. I'll say it really slow, right? <laughs> iPhone. Yes. <laughs> you, ever, you, you always do that with deaf people. You talk slower. Yeah, I know, <laughs> and louder. That's like, they're or, or, deaf. Yeah, it also works for dumb people, right? Yeah. right I, I'm not writing fast because I know you read slowly. <laughs> anyway. Okay. All right. Yes. Uh, it uh, replaces what occurred. Uh, we're not going to do the 007 thing. All right, so here's where I want you to play, guys. Mm. Uh, what's real? It really comes down to this whole thing. Neville talks about this outer world and this inner world. What's real is you. As soon as you deny the reality of either one of those, as soon as you go, right now, no, that their physical reality thing, right? Okay, what? We got Jonathan here. Let's do this live, right? Mm. All right. If the world out there is an illusion... <laughs> right i want jonathan's iphone even if he doesn't have one right it's like if it's an illusion send me your illusion right i'll take it it'd be so much fun when this <laughs> victoria would be going what's all this shit in the letter box is that it's people's illusions, illusions. right they're coming to us see when people tell me is it mr 20 yeah, i'm the only real one in my world and you're an illusion and i say go fuck yourself and they go well that wasn't nice this is you're not nice to yourself are you Right? Like, it's just like, no, come on, let's play. Let's dance a little bit. There's the outer world. There's that inner experience. The inner experience leads the outer world. Neville doesn't say one's not true. You know, uh -huh. Neville says one follows the other. You lead, you drive the bus. <sighs> you know what? I'm There's happy a lot of work. words in that quote. And for me, there I are. thought revision was really just all about changing your reaction totally to a past event and Damn. i get that that, yes. that then is changing your inner world if you change your reaction which then will change your outer world and and would then literally change the past 
because it's your reaction to the past. Yes. But there's just <clears throat> a lot in that quote that it just feels a bit wordy for me. <laughs> Let, let's play a little game. Ready? Okay. So here's a really fun thing to notice. You ever notice you can just say something to someone like, hey, that outfit does not make your butt look fat. Yeah. Right? And then after you say something like, hey, that outfit doesn't make your butt look fat. Right? And then suddenly it's like, radio. Like, yeah, for, forever and ever, amen, afterwards, there's friction. Right? It's like, like hey, well, you don't let me look at your outfit or your butt anymore, right? Now, now here's the thing. The, 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 the meaning of the communication is determined by the, by the listener, right? Yeah. Now, here's the fun thing, right? So suddenly there's awkwardness between human, two human beings because one said, hey, that outfit doesn't make your butt look fat. <laughs> it doesn't, right? That outfit does not make your butt look fat. <laughs> And so, and, so, and so you do that, and there's friction. Then most pe then then the both both the people don't like each other anymore. Then they fall apart and all this stuff. But on the other hand, what if you took everything as a compliment, right? Hey, the outfit doesn't make my butt look Sex. bad. Boom, right? We yeah. found an outfit that doesn't lie. <laughs> it's exactly. Oh, baby, <laughs> it doesn't lie. Exactly. Joel understands. Yes. So yeah. audio slipped out again. Just a moment. Well. No. <laughs> Angela, yeah, but, by the way, there's no way we can fix things on the fly. Yeah. <laughs> so it's sort of like, oh well, you know, it's this thing called fresh book. <laughs> Say it again. Uh, yeah, fresh book. <laughs> Alrighty. So okay. have fun with this. Revise your yes. reactions. And by the way, here's something that's cool. What if somebody actually insults you? And you're too dumb to accept it, right? I'm like this all the time, right? Some people are too dumb to accept compliments. I'm too dumb to, to accept a uh, insult. an insult, right? And I go, oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> Meanwhile, they've, they've thought they've insulted you and you're like, yay. <laughs> yeah, I'm the boom in the room, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so anyway. Okay. Excellent. So, tell us what was your hashtag strawberry bit. This is going to be the greatest hashtag strawberry bit. What was ever. yours? Uh, mine, this whole thing, it comes down to that whole thing of active imaginer. Whatever's going on, you're driving the bus. That's Manifesting Mastery Course Week 1, mm -hmm. Dream Driven Day, the first three lessons. You know, <laughs> it's just good fun. There's lesson number one, lesson number two, lesson number three. <laughs> But anyway, uh, that whole thing, yeah, be the active imaginer. Do not be the passive, oh, the past is haunting me again. It's like, what, what yeah, haunting you? Haunting oh, the, past. the past. It's like, you know yeah. what, I've got nothing better to do than to inf infect myself with the past again. Mm. Anyway, that's my strawberry bit. It's mm. sort of woven in with it all. Okay. All right. That, and that whole thing that your butt does not look fat. Yeah, I was going to say that's that my strawberry bit. <laughs> yeah, your butt does not look <laughs> fat because my of an butt outfit. look fat in this outfit? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. No, I don't I, know. I'm not sure <laughs> what, what, was, to say. what was that supposed to mean. <laughs> I know. Uh. <laughs> okay, so that was our hashtag strawberry bits. Were well, you typing yours? Excuse me. Oh, that is the rightness. Go oh, go. hello, go Welcome go. To the We're show. finishing. Oh. You have to watch the refund. Go to easymanifestingmethods.com. That's right. Jonathan's going to manifest a new iPhone. Yeah. Mm. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that whole promotions. You know, click link yes yeah. thank join our 90 day adventure at manifesting mastery course.com we love manifesting mastery course.com 20 does love uh, manifesting uh, yes i do <laughs> i'm good at manifesting all kind of things mm. and for refunds visit our youtube channel feel it real fun com. that's right that's right all right i might even get to the pool early and back early you might that'd be fun for pork chop I love. Ooh, oh, wait till really you guys see thick. the pork chop. Oh, like seriously, be yum yum oh. yum. First class. Oh, look at that. My dog is eating my dog. <laughs> okay, you guys have a great day, night. Have a well, lovely actually, day, a everyone, and we will catch you on our Friday, your Friday, Thursday. Your manifesting questions answered live. Good Angela Teresa. She's typing letters like she's dyslexic again. I oh, know. <laughs> I think she is dyslexic. Is she? Yes. Oh, there you go, Angela. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know. That's right. See, I'm, I'm amazed. I've got this memory. I, I've got a, I've got a memory like a steel block. <laughs>